Hi, I'm Paige from Pagey World, and in today's tutorial I'm just going to do a quick sketch on how to draw um, the circus makeup that I usually draw. So I'm just going to be doing a sketch, so I'll just start with a circle, and then the weird triangle, triangle thing, just for my guidelines. I'm just going to leave the sketch at that um, for pencil. That's just my pencil outline. And I'm just going to jump straight to markers because I'm just doing a quick sketch. So, just going to do the eyes. And the color I'm using right now is T9, which is a gray. Whenever I do um, sketches that I color, I always like to just jump to um, using marker instead of fine liner because then it just, to me, it makes it seem more like a sketch and not like I'm trying to do a full drawing. <clears throat> so when you when you color right over the pencil, like what I'm doing right now, you're gonna um, you're gonna <laughs> want to remember that the pencil, if you're using a very light colored marker, it's going to ruin the the, um, the ink on your pen. So you're just going to want to be careful because um, before you do another drawing with your pens, you're going to have to make sure you smudge all of that pencil off of your marker and you're just going to permanently have like a kind of dirty looking nib. But it's just a sketch for now. Oh. I do this all the time, but I also, um, I always clean my markers regularly, so it's all good. <clears throat> so now I have a face, and I'm just going to start coloring the, the small areas with pink, because I'm not c fully coloring everything, because it's just a sketch. So Filling in some lips there, a little bit of cheek color, and that's really all that I'm doing for the skin. And I'm just, as you can see, um, the tip of this pen is now like all black, and that's because I colored over um, pencil. So, if you don't want dirty looking markers, I wouldn't suggest doing this. Um, and if you do something like this, I would suggest buying um, spare nibs. For your um, pens, so then you can change them when they get dirty. Um, next, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just color on some eye makeup. It's a very dark color, but that's okay. It'll look cool. I'll use a little bit more. I'm just using random blues that I have. And this one, this one's dying, which works out really well, because then I can shade. Uh, I think what I'll do next is I'm just going to color in the hair with E47. And this is just a sketch, so I'm not going to worry too much about um, streaking or multiple colors or blah blah blah. Sketches are just meant to be like quick doodles. They're not supposed to be like, don't, whenever you're making a sketch, what I really like about sketching is you can just be fearless with anything because you're only going to spend like five minutes on a sketch. So. I try not to worry about little things when I'm doing sketches because they're just quick things that I'm making. I'm not trying to make them into something really beautiful. It's not something that's planned, which is why I haven't fine lined. Um, and I find that when you're fearlessly doing everything, it ends up looking like a way nicer sketch than if you actually start trying with it. So if you're just sketching with no intentions of, of making something nice, don't worry about spending like a long, long time on it and c or coloring it really nicely or anything because 
It's just a sketch. You're not going to do much with it. So that's the hair, and I'm just going to leave it like that. <clears throat> so now I have a base going on of what my character is going to look like. I'm just going to color the eyes like that. You know, this isn't like a, hmm, be 47 in the eyes. I thought I grabbed black. <clears throat> Anyways, oh, forgot to color in the eyebrows. Okay, so now I can start on circus makeup. After, wait, after I do a little bit more black in there. So just to find the eyes way more. Add some eyelashes. Ooh, really big, fun eyelashes. Okay. So for circus makeup, I really like the diamond look. So I often put diamonds on my characters. So I start with one near like the middle-ish area of the eye. Then I do the one on the outside bit. And then the one on the inside. And I would suggest doing circus makeup after you color the skin. I often do my circus makeup first in fine liner, but it always ends up getting the skin color you choose all like dirty. So I I suggest doing it after, but stuff happens. And then what I did today was I did a circle and then a heart and then another circle on the there, but you can't see it. And then I added a couple circles on the top. <clears throat> and you can do a lot of things with circus makeup. Um, you can do the whole like clown stripes coming down the eyes or whatever, but I like diamonds personally, so I just like drawing diamonds. And now I'm just going to add some strokes in the hair. Yay! And there's a quick circus sketch. Yay! All done. Thank you so much for watching my video on how to draw circus makeup. Um, for more tutorials, please check out my app, Pagey World, and check out my website, pagedraw.com. Thank you. For more information about the Pagey World Circus Contest, please go to www.pagedraw.com slash contests. Please join. Bye! Thanks for watching.